What a fluffing joke this dude is. And Elena turned me down. God. What did I do to deserve this? You can't be fighting with the other recruits. You need those men to have your back. There's enough out here trying to kill us without trouble amongst our own. You're right. I'm sorry. I'm Garrett. Crossfinger told me about you. Seems to think you might be trouble. What? You might be right. He said worse about me. <laughs> he said you fought for the North with the Foresters. You were there at the Twins. Yes. I still don't understand. Three thousand men, and not one could save my brother. Why didn't anyone fight back? Why didn't they rally to their king? We fought as best we could, but it wasn't enough. The phrase cut us open. Those cowards. Couldn't face Rob like men, so they stabbed him in the back. Oh, I love Jon Snow. They couldn't even give him an honorable death. Let him die fighting. Walder Frey and Roose Bolton will pay for their treachery. I'd like to believe you, but men like that don't get what they deserve. Ah, oh, so true. Now the Freys command River Run, and the Boltons are wardens of the North. After what they did, it's not right. They murdered my family. I should have been there. I keep thinking if I'd been there, I could have done something. Ah. Uh. But chances are, I'd be dead too. Whatever I once thought, my place is here. With the night's watch. Oh my gosh, come on, Jun! It sucks that they have to be at the wall, but... There are those here who will hate you for who you are. Southerners who will call you traitor. Northerners who will call you craven. Some won't even have a reason. They'll hate you anyway. You can't do anything about it. Trust me, I know. Why would they hate me? No. Oh. You're different than them. Most of the men are criminals forced to take the black. You were a squire for a noble house. What happened to you today happened to me more times than I can oh. I learned there's nothing more important than having brothers you trust. Whoa. The North. I... I felt the same first time I saw it. I heard you want to be a ranger. Why? Why risk your life out there? To find the North Grove. The North Grove? <laughs> you serious? Old Nan used to tell us a tale about ice dragons and trees tall as the sky. Why would you want to find the North Grove? Why does it matter to you? It's important to House Forrester. Oh boy. Better keep that to yourself. Cause Jon Snow is trustworthy. Not many recruits want to be rangers. They'd rather stay here where they think they'll be warm and safe. But Mance Raider marches on the wall with a hundred thousand wagons. I've seen them for myself. The men here are murderers, thieves, rapers. You won't like most of them, and they won't like you. But they're your brothers now. Can you stand with them? Can you see past your differences? I'll stand with them. Glad to hear it. Mm. I'd say you'll get used to the cold. 
but you will. Come on. Better get by a fire, or you'll end up like Frostfinger. <laughs> Should I reveal that to Jon Snow? In the show, he's a very trustworthy person, so I will trust him by revealing the North Grove. I didn't even think it would matter because we're up north anyway. It's like, no, nothing... I don't know. Where are we at? I'm here, but where are you? I am Lady Mira. I. Oh, jeez. The Varys? Oh, my gosh. This guy? Hello? Where do you oh. think you're going? At this time of night? I, I was just headed back to my room. It's a little late to be out, isn't it? Do you know what this uniform means? It means you serve the Lannisters. Uh. So, you best get yourself back to your chambers. And I mean, now. If you don't like it, you can take it up with the commander. Is there no way I can change your mind? Did you not hear me? At ease, Lucan. The lady is with me. Who is this yes. guy? Sir. Enjoy your I hope he wasn't bothering you, my lady. I'm Damien. You were in the throne room earlier. What brings you to the gardens? You do. You got my note. That was you. I'm very glad you could make it. I've been wanting to talk to you for quite some time. What do you know about Lord Tyrion? Oh, I could tell you a great deal about the Imp. I don't know anything about this guy. I can't trust him. I can trust Tyrion. I am sorry about this, Mira. But you've made enemies of the wrong people. A handmaiden should know her place. What people? I'll make this quick if that helps. I'd hate to see you suffer. <gasps> Nice. Yes, what a beast. No, no. I'm gonna get blamed for this. I'm gonna get killed. This sucks. You did what you had to do, Lady Mira. You had no choice. I need to get back. Someone might see me. I'll take care of you. I know a few places in Fleabot. What a beast! No one will ever find him. We should talk about this later. I'll find you. There's red marks around my neck. You're all right, sir. <gasps> Damien, 
Where are you? Oh. Ditch the knife. <laughs> that was the right move, right? If I kept the knife, it's evidence that I did kill somebody. If I threw the knife, they didn't have DNA technology back then, so they don't know who killed him. But if I kept a knife, I could have proved he attacked me? No. This'll heal. I'll wash the blood off. She's still here. What's Gwyn Whitehill doing here? Wait, who? No idea. Hello, Roderick. Sir Ryland. It's been a while since we've met. Yes. Last time I saw you, you and my brother had almost started a war. Your father wanted to murder Russia for your little love affair, remember? That was a long time ago. May we speak privately? My lady. Roderick, I came here because I know how hard these past few days must have been for you and your family. I know my words probably mean nothing to you. Thank you, Gwyn. I'm so sorry, Roderick. Your brother didn't deserve this. No, he did not. Listen, I know my father is intent on using Ryan as a hostage, but I think you deserve some news of him. I know it's little consolation, but if I can offer you this, it's something at least. So you have news of Ryan? Yes, he's well. Not happy, but just know your brother is safe at High Point. I'm looking after him, but... What? Oh. The other day he said something that made me worry. He asked me if his father died because he was a coward. He asked if he was really a thief and a traitor like my father says. I don't wish to upset you, but... Please help him, Gwyn. Don't let him believe what your father tells him. I've been doing my best to set him right. But he is only a child. He feels forgotten. Alone. He's waiting for a family, <sighs> but every day my father tells him they will never come. That they've chosen their pride over him. And with each passing day, those words start to sound like truth. Tell him to stay strong. Have him repeat our house words every day until I come for him. Of course. But if you truly want to bring Ryan home, this war has to end. You know that. <sighs> we don't have to be enemies, Roderick. I don't know who to trust anymore. It's good to see you, Talia. I hope I can count on your discretion. Roderick, you should speak to Mother. Mm, man. Mother. Come join the others. He should be here. He should be with his family. But instead they send her. Gwen came here on her own. She wanted us to know Ryan is okay. It's happening all over again. Why? I can see it. My father's house was once mighty like this one. But his loyalty to the Targaryens cost us dearly. I watched as countless of our kin fell, saw our lands destroyed, everything we clung to was ripped from our hands. I can't watch that same fate before this family. Our house. My children. I won't let that happen to us. Trust Roderick. You must be ready to defend us, Roderick. Your body may be damaged, but your spirit must be like iron. You let nothing stand in your way, do you understand? If you have to murder every last White Hill down to the babes in their beds, no matter what, you must do it. Promise me. It won't come to that. We will defeat them. War asks much of a man that he is not prepared to give. You must be ready. Promise me. We will be ready, Mother. Mira, Asher, even Garrett. They all stand with That's us. That's right, Garen. We are strong. Yes. I suppose we have to be.
Would you say a few words, my lord? Sure. Everything. Everything I ever wanted to be. Man. He showed me what it is to be a lord. He was always kind. I never knew. Better man. Greg the good. And I am. I am sorry. I love you, father. Hmm. Mm. Ethan, my little brother. When I left, he was just a boy. But when his house needed him, he rose to the task like a lord. He would have been proud. Lego <sighs> <sighs> Forrester, my husband. My love and our Lord Ethan, my sweet little boy. <laughs> but now is time to say goodbye. Are those like ironwood seeds? Father and son are returned to the earth, to the ice, and from their sacrifice, new life begins. Iron from ice. Lord Ethan died so young. From eyes, from eyes, we first is born to eyes, we all return. I've sworn, I've sworn to guard this rest you've earned. I'd bear my neck to win in pain and swim. Is this the end? Oh man! What's gonna happen?
going on? What? What is going on? Roderick, you have to do something. Lord Whitehill's son has arrived. Griff Whitehill means to tor Griff Whitehill means to torment us. Nothing worse than a fourthborn with something to prove. It was bad enough when it was just the soldiers. We can't live with them under our roof. Form up and follow my lead. You'll be taking your vows. You too, Tuttle. Time to start proving you're a brother. Oh, the things we do for family. I wonder sometimes if it's worth it. All the sacrifices. Enjoy the wedding. How much further to Marine? A few days. If the Lost Legion doesn't catch up to us first. No. I overheard a couple of men whispering about the Lannister Guard. They're questioning people. Is there anything else we need to be worried about? What was that? Oh, God. Okay. Good. You could have won her betrothal? Wow. So it was a 50-50 shot on getting Elena Glenmore to marry you. Oh, son of a gun. <clears throat> Man, that really grinds my gears. Here's, here, here's the plan. While she sings. Here's what's gonna happen. Um, I need to rely on Asher getting an army. That's what I need. Because we're not gonna. I don't think we're gonna. Son of a gun. I don't think we're gonna have the Glenmores to help us out. But if I get Asher to get an army, or at least get him to talk to Daenerys Targaryen, give me the second sons, we could own the White Hills. I don't think she'll do that. Get some sort of army hired. As far as Mira goes, I say. That's tough, I don't know. Should I lie? Or should I let Tyrion in on it and have him worry about I was getting attacked. I made an enemy with someone and I don't know who. Probably the dudes who uh the White Hill people. White Hills are generally bad. I the the jury is still out on Gwyn. So um But in episode three goal is Gary needs to become friends with all his brothers because they will they they will protect me if I protect them that's the main goal Roderick we need to figure out a way to control this White Hill situation Asher you get the army Mira I don't know if we're gonna lie or tell the truth I mean it's gonna look bad if I threw the knife it's gonna not gonna help my case that I got rid of it I don't know if lying is the right situation or who I tell the truth to and who I lie to but I know I'm definitely going to get questioned about it. Because what's-his-face saw me in there? The, one of the Lannister soldiers? I wanna be, I'm definitely going to get asked. So I need to decide if I'm going to be telling the truth or what. But let's hope the next episode comes out soon. Uh, I'm hoping here in March. It, this episode came out, what, January? Hope in March. Maybe not. Maybe April. But anyway, I want to thank you guys for watching this uh, Lost Lord session of Game of Thrones. That'll probably be this will probably be coming out after. Right now, I'm uploading the Bright Lord DLC. After that, I'll start uploading up this this on to. Well, you guys have already seen all my episodes if you watch this. So anyway, thank you guys for watching. Hope you guys have the rest of your day. Stay tuned for episode three, The Sword in the Dark. I think it's called. All right, bye.